Hey guys, Blue here. So, we have some good news and some very bad news. And we are going to start with the bad news. Act 5 has dropped, which we were hoping for, and it has been released. The very bad news, though, is that they have royally screwed up the mission rewards. So, I jumped in and did the first lane in the first mission, and it's a mess. As you can see, you are now getting a whopping 10 bot chips, a little bit of T1 essence and some repair kits, and the exploration rewards are not even there. As I'm sure you know, um, with the mission rewards from basically all of Act 4, we should be getting, you know, T5B sparks, extra T5B essence, T5C essence, as well as lots of bot chips. <clears throat> Instead, we're getting, you know, T1 rewards, and I thought, okay, maybe it's just the first one, but I went into the second one, it's basically the same thing, right? You're getting <laughs> T1 rewards, and then a pretty incredible T2 basic spark for completing the next chapter. So this is an obvious, very disappointing screw-up on their part. So if I were you, I would not bother to go through the mission yet, wait for it to be fixed. I am going to contact Netflix tomorrow. I recommend that you do the same. I know it's annoying, but we do want to put pressure on them because we don't want it to take weeks or even months for it to get fixed like a lot of other issues have. So the really disappointing thing in this, of course, besides the fact that it shouldn't have happened, is the fact that if you were hoping to amass a bunch of, you know, T5B and T5A and T5C to rank up a bot or two over the next week, you won't be able to do that unless and until they fix it. So I don't know how they screwed that up, but they did. So I'm not going to bother with it. I would suggest you don't bother going through it yet. I mean, you can, and they very well may just retroactively give us the rewards for everybody who completes it, kind of like they did with that, the T5C issue, right? If you remember, the T5C shards had been glitched for a long time, <clears throat> but I don't trust them with this kind of thing because they don't communicate. So I am just going to hold off on doing any more of this until the issue is fixed. On top of that, we did notice one thing here that Chapter 2 is coming out in three weeks, actually in 22 days, which is a bit odd. And then Chapter 3 comes out about a week after Chapter 2, and then Chapter 4 comes out two weeks after Chapter 3. Now, I don't know if that's intentional or if that's another screw-up, but for the time being, uh, for whatever reason, Chapter 2 is in three weeks, and then Chapter 3 is a week after that. So that just means that Cyclonus, who is coming in Chapter 2... Uh, will be in three weeks, at least as of now, instead of two. So that's a little bit disappointing as well if you've been waiting for him. Now, the chapter rewards do seem to be intact, right? The T5C and the T5A and the Relic and everything. Those are probably fine. So if you really want to just go through it to get these sparks, you can. But like I said, I would just hold off and wait to see what happens. So that's the unfortunate reality for the beginning of Act 5. Okay. The good news, however, is that we do have some additions to the store. And the really exciting news is that Windblade is back. She has arrived. So that's really cool. Um, she's a warrior now, but her kit is mostly the same as it was in the old game. So if you loved Windblade, as I did, um, you can now pick her up and add her to your team. They have also added both Jetfire and Galvatron to the store. So obviously we got the five-star versions from the story, but you can now get, say, a four-star Galva or a three-star Jetfire, et cetera, et cetera. So if you uh, do work on, uh, if you are ranking up or you have ranked up Galvatron or Jetfire, you can now get the lower tier versions of them helpful for forging purposes. So it is really good to have Windblade back, but the Act 5 rewards are a total mess, and so we just have to hope that that gets fixed as soon as possible. So uh, once they do fix it, you know, I will update you guys, and hopefully it is sooner rather than later, but for the time being, it is what it is. So I hope all of you are well, and we will be in touch again soon. Take care.